welcome everybody to uh, Brew Review University. We're your hosts, Jennifer and Donnie, and we're still at the Full Wave Studios grand opening, and we have another artist for you guys, Stephen Giles. <laughs> so let's jump into it. <laughs> How do you know Richard? I know Richard. I met him last summer, at, like almost exactly this week, uh, at a recording camp in Santa Monica, which I actually just finished this week's and then came here so I could sing at the grand opening of Full Wave. So that's how I met Richard last year. Awesome. I listened to a little bit of your music online. I, I went to Instagram wow. and watched a little bit of it. And I was trying to figure out a style. I was uh, trying to think, uh, yeah. what would you call yourself? Um, <laughs> I do a lot of different music. Like I do stuff with bands. I do stuff solo acoustic. So, I guess I would call what I do um, indie folk, uh, like kind of singer song. I mean, if you just the basic level singer songwriter. I caught that. Yeah. And, and I yeah. say that because I thought I could put a cowboy hat on this guy, <laughs> and it would and it would be you know somewhat somewhat okay. Yeah. You, know, I you was could thinking, you could throw a cowboy hat. I, 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 I would not identify as country. <laughs> But um, I'm country adjacent, <laughs> so uh, I, I, I don't hate country music. Um, yeah, it's but I do like folky stuff, it's like boom, you know, I have yes. songs like that. Yes, absolutely. I, I, I heard that. And then I have like really sad, sappy, like emotional stuff, and and I do silly, so like ridiculous songs. I have a whole album of songs about Minecraft. <laughs> Um, but I do under a different name, but um, I, I, I had kids and I, I was a middle school, I'm a middle school teacher. So I uh, do things with, I do things with kids all the time. So like I have a lot of random stuff like that and I have some very serious music. I have, I have songs that have been placed in a bunch of different TV shows um, and stuff that's like more like rock and more intense and not folky at all yes very different like yes. you could hear very different versions of me by just hearing different like bands that i'm in or yeah. groups that I'm in. yes yes so, i did hear a a large variety of things you do and i was like yeah it's really is, hard to pigeonhole no it's really lane yeah for this guy. it was I, like wow i i probably for what i do when i perform it's probably more like the folky singer songwriter stuff i do play with bands sometimes and it's like maybe a different vibe but yeah. for recording i record all the time and and i record so many different styles that i just get bored yeah. of doing one thing so yes I how like many instruments do you play um you... i play guitar as my primary instrument i play bass i play drums um, I can play a little bit of keyboards, like all the white keys. They're all the white keys, I'm fine. <laughs> if I have to get the black keys in there, it gets a little more confusing, but uh, I, I can play basic chords on, on those instruments. Okay. You have a question for Do you have a musical influence? Yeah, a bunch. Um, my first, probably my first influence would be like Simon and Garfunkel, mm -hmm. um, like kind of that 70s folky stuff. I caught that. Yeah. Um, and then, um, in the 90s, I was a, you know in college, so you had Nirvana, Smashing Pumpkins, Soundgarden, uh, this band called Pavement that I was really into that most people haven't heard of. Um, and uh, yeah, I, I, you know, I like Bob Dylan, I like Tom Petty, I like, um, I just love music. So there's so much, it's amazing how much music is out there. Like in new music, like I listen to new music all the time just because it's still so good. It's still so much good sure. stuff. And I really like weird electronic stuff and really hard metal and folk and that's, that's her jazz. Hard, and hard metal. Like sure. I really, I really do enjoy like a lot of, I can appreciate the musicianship yeah. that goes into it. Um, it may not be what I listen to all the time. I'm not listening to like Sepultura or Pantera or like, you know, like, <laughs> or whatever, like the really like heavy, heavy metal bands. But I love some of that stuff and I like, you know, I can appreciate yeah. any good music, you know, so. Even some bad music. <laughs> yes, <laughs> like, yes, we, we hear a lot of that. <laughs> yeah. So, your first live performance, how old were you? And, oh God. to what, what kind I, of crowd did you My do? first live performance. Okay, I think what I would qualify as my first live performance was at youth group in church okay. and they had like a like a talent show 
and we did a lip sync of a heavy metal band. And so I was <laughs> lip syncing the guitar, right. and it had smoke and lights. And I remember being very excited, like, I'm like, I could do this. I think I could do this. I like this. Yes. And uh, then I started trying to learn how to actually play. And yes. Yeah. Nice. That was my first, that's the first performance I remember. Yeah. So like sometime in junior high. Okay. And biggest crowd? Biggest crowd. And, and I have a follow-up question for okay. that. Okay. Okay. Biggest crowd. We played one show that was like... A couple thousand people like it was a big like a huge warehouse and we were opening for uh, it was like a skate part it was like a skater band okay. there were like a bunch of professional skaters that had a band um, and we were the opening band so there was like thousands of skater kids in this huge warehouse that was really cool and we felt very out of place but it was fun and I, I asked that because stage fright Every time bef right before I get on, I'm a little like anxious. Edgy, yes. um, and then once I'm going, I'm usually like, I'm usually fine. Um, I've had moments that were like pure terror. Um, <laughs> yes. Like when there's a lot of people, it feels a little more, you know, like I feel a little more pressure. Yes. But once I start, I just, because I've done it so many times, I just kind of go. You know, and yes. you hope everything goes right and you don't break your string or, <laughs> you know, like something horrible happens, but. Yeah, I, 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 in general, I'm not, I'm okay when I'm on stage, once I'm on. So do you have a question for him, or I any more questions? I think we should just jump into the beer. That's what I'm thinking, too. a lot of beers in <laughs> That's what I'm thinking, too. So let's get into the beer. Uh, start it, well, actually, you know, let's yeah, start on this side. Okay, okay, okay. Because I think that by the time we get over there... <laughs> By the time we get over there, that that is okay. Uh, you think that's different. you think this is my going to be my. Preferred. Well, I think okay. I think that that will ruin your palate for anything like this. Oh, all right. Because the hops in this will take over your palate. Okay, all right. This is a takeover. Drink. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. So we're starting here. Yes. All right. So this is the Hell or High Watermelon. Hell or High Watermelon. Which is a great name. Yes. They're out of San Leandro, California. Twenty First Amendment. Twenty First Amendment. 21st Amendment. What is the 20? Okay, what 21st is that? Amendment is the name of the company. Oh, okay. All right. Because <laughs> yes. I was like, is there a 21st Amendment? <laughs> Did I yes. miss this? Yes. I missed one. Okay. Yes. All right. Okay. Let's so try that. Tell us what you think okay. of that. I was going to say, don't make me Google something. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. It's nice. It's, uh, try a little more. It's light. It's, uh, refreshing. I thought I tasted watermelon for some reason. It is water. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, that's right. Hell or high water. Stupid. It's literally, it's literally in the name. I haven't even been drinking yet. But obviously, I mean, we gotta cut you I off I tasted already. a little watermelon <laughs> in this hell or high watermelon. Yes, caramel. Like caramel. Cut it all. It's trash. I like that. It's good. It's very light. Yes. Um, okay. Next is Mother Earth Brewing Company. They're out of Vista, California. <laughs> okay. All right, Mother Earth. Here so we go. this is an orange creamsicle. Orange creamsicle. That sounds amazing. <laughs> so I love ice cream and I like beer. So this should be possibly the greatest thing I've ever had. <laughs> yes. Ooh, that's really good. See now you know. I like I sweet. Like it. I do. I I do. I tend to like sweeter drinks too. Like yeah. even like liquor drinks I like sweeter things um, yeah okay so if I were like which one I would want more I would definitely want this one more this is not bad this is very refreshing though I thought it was very yes. refreshing but definitely this is too drink. it feels light yes um, but I, I love that oh god I'm gonna be I have to... <laughs> okay I have to stop okay that's good I like it okay I'm gonna actually have you switch this can, this drink with that one, and can we're gonna do yes. Okay, All we're right. gonna do I'm gonna go that here one first. first. Yes. Okay. All right. And this is the. This oh. is from Belching Beaver. They are also out of San Diego, California. Okay. And this is a peanut butter milk stout. Mmm. Okay. Again, so lots of things that I like. <laughs> peanut it. butter. Tell milk. us what you think of that. All right. Did you do this like? Wine tasting. <laughs> yes. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, well, 
that's good too. It t- okay, I I'm like it's like coffee. I'm getting like a very coffee vibe going from here. Yes, most stouts are going to give you that coffee vibe. Um, this one is going to be a little bit smoother because of the milk it, in it. Yeah, it is really smooth. I and like it. It's then not bitter. You're going to get that peanut butter that kind of sticks to the back of your palate. I'm looking for the peanut butter now. Journey with me <laughs> to the peanut butter. <laughs> I'm not getting the peanut butter. Maybe, maybe I got wiped out by the creamsicle. Sure, we didn't have any water. Some water. Oh, like the palate cleanse in between. Yes, it's. I, I like it. It's good. It's smooth. You, you have so far like, I've really actually liked everything I've tried. So, are you guys like sampling all night as you do this? By the way, no, that's I'm pretty see great. If I can find the peanut butter. Okay, try you, to find you the peanut butter. To the next one. All right, am I going I'll to this one here? The peanut butter. I want you to do the cleaner IPA. Oh, you want me to go first, cleaner IPA? Which is the this okay. is Russian River. They are out of uh, I forget where Russian River is from. <laughs> okay. All right, Russian River. Yes, it's a California beer. <laughs> what, what am I? What am I expecting here, Donnie? What's happening? That to way. Me? What's going to happen? You're going to get a clean, very clean. This is a single hop IPA. So you're going to get hop. yes, you're going to get okay. one single hop. But it is going to be one of the cleanest IPAs you've probably ever had. Okay. <laughs> All right. You heard yes. it here first. <laughs> <laughs> cleanest IPA I've ever had. This is the cleanest IPA I've ever had. <laughs> and that's good. I, okay, honestly, if I'm being fully honest, I do not like this one as much as I like everything else I've had. Everything else. Yeah, so, I, do, I don't love it. Um, yes. But it is, it was And that's, that's what we want to hear. We want to hear what you like. This is not my favorite. Yes. But I'm going to try one more. It's not bad. It's not like, I'm not a, it's not, I wouldn't, I wouldn't pour it out. I would yes. finish it. And so my last favorite. one. I think I'm more. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Okay, wait, wait. Oh, wait, this one. Pseudo soup. Okay. Yes. Pseudo soup pale ale. Okay. This is Toppling right. Goliath. They are out of Decorah, Iowa. <laughs> pseudo soup. Okay, pseudo this soup. Is... I like the names. I love, I love new beer, uh, like how their the art, the graphic design. Yes. I think is, yes. like, is so cool. It's like really br- has taken me in. Okay, here we go. Pseudo soup. <laughs> Definitely. Excuse me. Let me clear. clear Definitely the a, a tropical, juicy, hazy is what you should be getting there. Yeah, that's good. That's a good one too. I like that. Yes. This is a, that's a really tough call of all of these. Like after, uh, that's really good. That's really <laughs> so good. I, I like these two. Here's the magic thing now. So we're gonna have you one through five. Your favorite out of these. Okay. I, I think my favorite was this actually. I think this was my favorite. I think I think uh, the uh, Cal what is it? Cal- yeah, Cal- 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 Cali Creamin. I think basically, I think yes. I'm basically I just like <laughs> I just like I think I just like this kind of thing. I'm not like a yeah. Okay. Jen, Jen smiling. Yeah. That's, that's her beer. That's, that's you call my beer. There you go. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Um. So that I think that was my number one. I think this was my I think that was my least favorite of them. I just, it didn't feel it to me like there wasn't a lot happening flavor-wise. Yes. Okay. That's Maybe it. my unrefined no. palate, no. which is very possible. <laughs> but, um, number two, I think, I think this would be down here. Like, I didn't hate it. I liked, I kind of liked it, but this, uh, let's see, what if I went here? <laughs> Like that. Like, I, I feel like I would experience. So, I think this was my number one, number two, three, four, and five. Good choice. Now, do you guys do you guys have, like, a game where you, like, try to decide if I what I will choose, and then the winner has to, like... <laughs> I, that would be a good game. That should be a side game that Bye. you play where you say, I say this guy's going... Do, 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 do. Yes. Bye, you say five you're bucks. a beer drinker. I, and I'm surprised <laughs> I'm start that, that. I'm not... Okay, I'm I, I drink beer. I drink beer. I wouldn't say I'm, like, a connoisseur by... 
and he's. I would say I was surprised that the Hell or High Watermelon is so far down. Even I re I really did it. like it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I actually really. I almost. I might flip flop those two, but this one. I'm driving later, so um, no, they're really good. They're all like I liked all of these. Actually, should be taken. I should be. I'm gonna take a picture of these before I go, because I don't want to forget. Then I like that. Okay. So this is what we got for you. We got okay. five more questions for you. Okay. They're gonna be really quick. Okay. Quick questions. I'm you ready? ready? Whatever. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Beer shot. Beer. Dog or cat? Cat. Cat dog. <laughs> <laughs> Pizza or hamburger? Pizza. Beach or mountains? Mountains. And staying in. Or going out. Uh, that's tough. I staying in. <laughs> Probably staying in. I, I like I like to do both, but yeah, I'm getting older. I like staying in my, yeah. little, my I, own I, comfortable I, bed. I yeah. agree. Yeah, we agree. So that's all we've got for you. We hope you enjoyed our beer samples here. Thank you. Yeah, that was great. This is like the greatest thing, like when you get a flight of beers at some place, but like <laughs> I get like full explanations and like it was custom designed for me. So I feel like yes. very special. Like I'm literally, I'm going to turn all these around to face me. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, audience. This is now, this is a special time for me. I'm going to take a, a picture. Oh, and I want a picture with you guys. Oh yeah. We'll I feel that. like, okay. So while he's taking his picture, <laughs> we just got to... <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Wrap up the show. Sorry. <laughs> well, uh, thank you, Stephen, for being on our show and trying all these thank five you for beers me. with us. We're glad uh, you chatted with us. Make sure you guys follow him um, on social media and everything. We will get everything on the um, podcast when it comes out at the bottom. Uh, show everybody some love. Give us some love. Follow us. Subscribe. You know, give everybody some love. So we love all our followers. But again. We'll cheers it out and uh, pick one, which one Let's you want. Go. All right, go. so cheers. 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 Next time. Thank you. <laughs>